planet 2,000 years ago. He's here tonight. He doesn't change at all. He still does impossible continually. It's up to us to simply believe him and reach out. In fact, I haven't seen Jesus heal atheists. I see Jesus healing the worst skeptics. We had a man who's a skeptic in a wheelchair, nine and a half years crippled, and he's blind. And uh, he went to a church that taught God. All the miracles ended with the apostles. And so his friend said, come on, we see miracles in power. Like little war miracles happen. And uh, he said, no, nah, as well as, I'm not into that sort of stuff. He said, come on, come on. So he said, and so the guy hounded him. He picked him up, brought him to the boat church where I go to, but uh, more body in Nambour. And during the meeting, God healed him. God opened his blind eyes, healed his legs. The platform went eight steps. He walked up the steps, shook his head, put his sunglasses on, had a little sign vision in person, which is pretty correct for blind. And he screamed out, I can see, I can see, it's all on video. And today, tonight, I interviewed him, and they asked the doctor, how did this man get healed? And they said, we just don't know. We don't know what happened to him. And you know, he said, he said, I was such a skeptic. I wasn't believing for anything. But he had faithful people who were believing for him. We came down yesterday and went to a meeting last night. He prayed for me. I felt a bit of a sensation in my ears. I felt fluid draining. I woke up a couple of times during the night and I felt there was something happening in my ears. And I could feel fluid. And I'm thinking, it sounds like it feels like it's not blocked. Because I've always had this blocked, heavy feeling in my ears. And I've had hearing aids basically almost 10 years, on and off for 10 years. And Right, and how much could you actually hear without the hearing aids? Probably about 56% hearing. Right. And that was it in both ears. So you were praying for last night, then the, something happened in the night. Yeah. And then this morning more happened at the, when John was praying. Yeah, I morning. just felt more fluid draining out of my ears. I was thinking, it doesn't feel like blockness, heaviness in there. Something's happened. Something, I just can't, I can't, it's really hard to explain. But something has happened. And what did doctors say to you? What there was nothing they could do. Hearing aids, they couldn't do any operation to me. Yes. Today, I could even hear behind my back. Yes. So I was speaking behind my back and I could hear for the first time. This is just, God, I've never been able to hear. Like John's been clearly there, I can actually hear it. Yes. That would be really hard. Right. Oh, and like, even people talking to me, I'm like, I'm not have to just struggle. It's, it's just awesome listening to being able to talk and hear myself. I'm like, I've missed my voice level has gone down so much. <laughs>
Jesus. God is sitting free. God is sitting half of his body right now. Sitting free. Sitting free in the name of Jesus. And it's prayer for me this time. I feel my knee is good, my shoulder is good. And I asked him again, I said my back is too sore. And he do it twice. said there was someone with lots of pain. Is that the one when you first went out or what? Uh, yeah. Okay. And what uh, what did you tell him when you talked to him? You just told uh, him all about that, did you? About my scoliosis and how it was never been able to lay on the floor and my horse accident and now I just feel wonderful. <laughs> Okay. Did you feel a sensation while while you were on the floor, or while you were well, while you were being prayed over for a start? I just felt God the whole time. Right. I've always had prayer for it, trying to help. And, and yeah. you went down on the floor for a while, did you, or what? Yeah, twice. <laughs> it's wonderful. I almost on the verge of being on dialysis, and now I just I just feel no pain. So your body feels a lot better. Yeah. Because um, without it, you, you feel pretty lethargic. I've always been run down and quite ill, and I just feel 100 again. <laughs> so you ready to go out running? Oh, maybe. <laughs> 